So me, this is me apologizing because I'm still getting used to carrying a camera around. But I forgot to get my stitch removal videotaped or recorded. So there it is, no stitches. It's gotta be cleaned up a lot. There's a lot of dead or dried blood there. But yeah, that was it. It wasn't very exciting anyway, so didn't miss much. But there, yeah, there it is. It's all done. Feels kind of weird. But we'll get it cleaned up. Alright. See you later. Okay, so stitches are out. Yay. But uh, it still looks disgusting. So I've got some paper towel here, I got some alcohol here. Clean this up a little bit. Is this gonna hurt? The alcohol doesn't hurt, but it's still a cut on my forehead. It's not the most comfortable thing in the world. Well, I think it's just gonna have to live with a scab for a while. I don't think, I don't think this dry blood wants to come off too, ba too badly. Uh, man. Starting to bleed again. Okay, so we leave it alone. So there it is. There it is. Scar stitches. Falling unconscious. Just another day in life of someone with MS. Hey -ho. um, I, today is, uh, I have the day off from work, so that's good, that's great. Um, it is about 10 o'clock in the morning, and today is spring cleaning day. Fun, fun. So here we go.
Hi there. Uh, I hope there's enough light. Uh, so, in uh, preparation for me going, uh, well, well, in my journey for or towards the Philippines, I've decided to do my best to learn Tagalog. So I've got a YouTube video here, just the first one that came up, learn Filipino in 30 minutes. Okay, let's give it a shot. Welcome to FilipinoPod101.com. Filipino sa tatlong minuto. The fastest, easiest, and most fun way to learn Filipino. Kamusta? Ako si Erika. Kinagagalak pong makilala ka. Hi, I'm Erika. Nice to meet you. In this series, we're going to learn basic Filipino expressions. It's super easy, and it only takes three minutes. In this lesson, you're going to learn how to introduce yourself in Filipino. Are you ready? Here we go. Kamusta? It's the next day, and uh, we are ready to get this baking soda off my carpet. Hopefully it worked, hopefully it removed the, the rest of that stain, and uh, it'll uh, be like it never happened. So uh, I'll, uh, I'll record it, but I'll, I'll, uh, I'll speed up the, 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 the recording, so it won't take, I don't know how long this is going to take, okay? So here we go. Just as, as just so you know what I've got going on, I've got uh, water and uh, just uh, cold, cold uh, tap water, and I'm just going to try and sponge it up. Here we go. stain's gone. Nice. Baking soda worked.
Hey there. Um, I have I've decided that I'm going to order in today. Um, <clears throat> so, and I'm going to order some Jollibee. Um, I've ordered them from, from there before. They're pretty good. Their chicken's not bad. Um, but today I'm going to try their spaghetti. According to my uh, girlfriend, May, it's, uh, it's different than regular spaghetti. But we're going to give it a shot. Um, so if we see here, I am just making the order. Uh, <clears throat> let's see, add-ons. No recommended beverages. Um, weird. Okay, hold on a second. I don't want a yam burger. I just want the spaghetti. Huh, it's weird. They don't give you a lot of options. Um, okay, I'm just gonna add that to cart and we're gonna do this a la carte. So I got the spaghetti, I want the spaghetti and I want dessert because they have the, uh, uh, the mango pie is actually quite good for a deep fried pie. Um, we are, here we go, peach mango pie. We'll add one of those. And then beverages, beverages. We want beverages. Here we go, pineapple quencher. That is also really good. So we'll do that. We'll view cart, selected items. And place order. There we go. So it's on its way. It'll probably be here while well, the delivery time said 51 minutes. So we will, uh, uh, we should time it. What time is it now? 5.20, it's 5, 5.20. We'll see, it says 51 minute delivery time. Well, they say 45 minutes, but. We'll see what it will we'll, we'll see how long it actually takes okay see you later all right so according to doordash my order has been picked up and is on its way arrives at approximately 555 which is in 20 minutes so we're still waiting. All right, catch up to you later. Hello. <clears throat> so the, 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 the uh, delivery arrived. Um, I just opened the bag to take a look, see what's inside. I know what's inside because I've made the order. <laughs> Peach mango pie, it's actually pretty good. Uh, cutlery, good. Straw. We have the pineapple drink. Everything's got tamper-proof seals now and stuff, so... Oh, there's, I gotta just put it through there. That's okay. Ugh. All right. So, I ordered the spaghetti. Um, so... According to a very good source, it is not your typical spaghetti. Okay, number one, it comes with cheese, which I don't mind, it's fine. Um, I would put cheese on spaghetti sometimes too. Um, but when I made the order, I specifically asked to have it removed, so it comes with, with cheese automatically. And then um, it apparently is a little sweet. So here we go. We're going to give this a try. Hmm. 
Well, I don't want to say it's sweet. I don't really get sweet. Um, it's a little bland for my taste. Um, well, let's have another bite. Maybe some, one with some cheese on it. It's all right. I don't know if I would order it again. Um, I mean, frankly, I'm not sure why it's so popular. Um, it's really nothing special. I don't know what to say. Oh yeah, yeah. It has hot dogs. Uh, yeah, I remember May saying that. Uh, it has hot dogs. That's funny. Now, what do they add to the dish? So we got some spaghetti, we got some cheese, and we got a hot dog. I'll get some of this off, I don't need to bite that big. All right. I mean, it's interesting to see spaghetti and hot dogs, spaghetti, cheese, and hot dogs. That's certainly novel. But I don't really think it adds anything. Yeah, I don't think I would order spaghetti again. Still have yam burger to try. Yam burger, or what is it called? Was it like yam burger? I have to look again. And uh, oh, I've tried the chicken. Uh, now the spaghetti, the yam burger. They have a very limited menu. Mmm. I have a shrimp dish. Yeah, they have a shrimp dish as well. So maybe we'll try that one next. Oh, lovely. Mm. There's a little bit of grease in the bottom of the tray. That's not good. That kind of turns me off, but... All that's left is the other hot dogs. Little 
cut up chunks of hot dog. So did I like it? It was okay. It wasn't anything special. Sorry, Jollibee. I can't give you a uh, rounding or a high praise on this one. I think it's probably average. The cheese and the and the and the uh, the hot dogs are definitely a novel idea, um, <clears throat> but really, I don't think it really does anything for the dish. But I'm no food critic. Ah, the pineapple quencher is pretty good. And then the mango pie for dessert. I mean, for a deep fried pie, like you would get at McDonald's, it's not something that I would order regularly. I actually try to eat pretty healthy. <clears throat> um, but this is, you gotta have the mango, the peach mango pie, so. Mm. Mm. Mm hmm. Oh, great. All over my shirt. It exploded. Mm-hmm.